In this lesson, we're going to discuss mixture stops. How do you find a mixture in a pipe organ? Well, mixtures are going to have a Roman numeral with the stop name. Now, in this organ here, we've got three mixtures. Two of them are what we call chorus mixtures, and the other one is called a solo mixture. Now, a chorus mixture is what is intended to be added on top of other stops, like 16, 8, 4, and 2 foot pitches. It adds harmonics, it enriches the harmonics uh, of what's below, and it adds a little bit of a crown to the, to the sound. Listen to the mixture here as I add it. Here's 16, 8, 4, and 2. Now the mixture. Now, mixtures don't ascend in the pitch as you go up, but they sound more likely the same throughout the compass. Watch. And the reason they sound very similar from one range to the next is that they break back. That is, this mixture, which actually is a four rank mixture, has four sets of pipes. And at each octave C, one of the pipes breaks back in pitch so that there's always this narrow range of pitch that it's conveying. Listen to the compass. This mixture breaks back on C's, the note C. Over here we have a two rank mixture. It breaks back, not at C, but at another note. Can you tell which one it is? Very interesting. This breaks back at the note F. Okay? So these are chorus mixtures. We have one here on the great, one on the swell. But we also have another mixture, a three-rank mixture on the great and it's designated by a Roman numeral three. It's a cornet. It consists of two and two thirds, one and three fifths, and two all together. And they do not break back, but they ascend just like any other normal eight foot or 16 or four or two foot stop from bottom to top. No breaking back there. And when you pull a stop like an eight foot under it, it has a beautiful, very rich harmonic quality. So there you have it. That is a solo mixture. And then we have our chorus mixtures. We have on this organ two mutation stops. One is pitched one and three-fifths, and another is pitched two and two-thirds. When I pull an eight-foot gedect on this division and play middle C, of course, I hear that, middle C. But if I play the same note on the Nazard, which is a two and two-thirds foot stop, I hear a G, which is a full octave and a half above middle C. And when I pull the tiers at one and three-fifths, the tiers gives us an E, which is two and a little more than two octaves, that is, above the middle C pitch at the eight-foot level. These two stops reinforce the harmonics that are present in these other stops, like eight-foot and four-foot. And when they are combined with an eight-foot pitch, it's a beautiful color. It brings these harmonics forward. Listen. Without them. And with. A lot of organs will have a variety of mutations at different pitch levels, but they'll all have a fraction. And so when you see them, this is a manner in which they would be used. They would be combined with eight foot stops to give added color 
to whatever you're playing on that other stop.